zero to 60 in four seconds. I enjoy the speed. The speed is unbelievable. You got Alan the youngest, he's uh, 15. This is my third year. He, he's a great little guy, boy, he could be annoying too. Laura is the next, and she's 18. She's been into go-karts in general for seven years. If anyone were to be a tomboy, I would say it would be Laura. Dana is the next, and she's 21. Well, I've been racing only for about, only about a year. Unfortunately, she ends up being the crowd please. And uh, Scott's 22. That's the oldest. I've been racing carts for 10 years this year. I am racing with my entire family. Racing shipper carts, all four of us. My sister, two brothers, and my mom and dad. You could say it was like bred into them. I mean, they didn't see them. <laughs> back as I can remember stories about racing. I used to street race. That's how I got to know him. Let's look at the jets. My dad has always been into drag racing. We met someone who had a go-kart. He got into the shifters real big. That's how it all started. Us being a family, we got to tag along pretty well. <laughs> we luck out being the siblings. When we get them where they work good and they go, go real fast, I'm really happy. You know, if it weren't for my dad, it wouldn't be possible at all. He works as hard as he can, seven days a week. I love mechanics, I'm an engineer. And he just hands us all the money to go racing. He just mowed the field. Got too close to the edge. Just couldn't correct it. Come on, stick it, now don't back out. Most moms don't really let their kids do this. She is the glue that keeps all of us together. Typically, most moms will say, you're going to get into an 80-mile-an-hour machine with no seat belts? Yeah, right. My mom's arguing about my engine not having enough power. She wants me to go faster down there. Oh, oh Scott! We're all centered around her. <laughs> if mom were to leave, we'd have no food. As a family, we do everything together. It is very unique because, um, for the most part, all the kids get along. We've just never done anything apart from the family. The family's always together.